When you go to the movies, sometimes you wonder if movie makers ever made a picture before. News Center 7's entertainment reporter Peter Lundquist has found some student filmmakers at the University of Miami getting their feet wet, so to speak. Nobody's going to pretend Steven Spielberg started out as a great filmmaker. He started out, then went to college to learn how to make films, just like the people who made this film. It's called Roses for the Matador, one of the films made at the U of M this year. The first showing of films like this one was last week at the University of Miami, a presentation ranging from first efforts to final projects. They're anything but dull, unusual and rough sometimes, but pick one of the two dozen or so short films out and you never know what to expect. Roses for the Matador is one of the major efforts. There are several. Ah. Ah, about six or so. Six? Where were you all night? What happens here on a regular basis is that the students who spend all this time and effort at U of M graduate, produce something noteworthy, and go to Los Angeles. They're trying to change all that. So we really provide the missing link to make the industry really happen in, in, in South Florida. And that if we're going to have a motion picture industry, the people that are going to make it happen come from our humble facility here. And that's why you sit down a room full of people, or a theater full, like at the Grove Cinema Saturday night, and treat yourself to a couple of hours of very unusual entertainment. Peter Lundquist, News Center 7. Miami Vice fans can rest easy. Your favorite show is staying right in your favorite city.